Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, I'm gonna make this video recording my screen. I'm right now sitting at Costco. See if I can get another batch. Uh, and I'm gonna show you what I do exactly on the app uh, to try to refresh and get rid of all these um, tech issues. So let, let's get started that. Um, go here on this spot where I am on the parking lot. I got pretty nice speed as you can see. So now let's go back to uh, uh, Instacart. As you can see, I have the location off on my phone. And what I do to refresh is just go back and forth from earnings or ratings to the shopping. And then you can go here in settings, refresh, and then just keep refreshing, refreshing, refreshing until we get something. I don't know if I'm gonna get something but this is how I do it so hopefully you guys also can see results uh, by doing this so yeah let's see let's see let's see I'm gonna play some music in the meantime so we can um, listen to something I hope it's not too loud but yeah let's uh, listen to Maluma Let's see, you can see no badges, I'm at Costco right now, refresh, try to refresh, turn on the location off again, and let's see, yeah, there, you see, sometimes it's going to ask you to turn it on again, so you turn it on again, and refresh, and one pops out, that's from Marietta, no tip, you see, it's a heavy uh, I mean uh, boost what the boost means is that nobody wants to take it and Instacart is just adding like an incentive to the shopper so they can go get it but no there's no tip I don't take any orders with no tip um, because that's teaching the customers that they can get away with that and then they are I feel like not tipping is disrespectful so I don't want anybody to disrespect me, so I don't take those orders. Pro I have maybe like one or two times where there's just like two, three items and it's less than one mile and I know I'm going to uh, do it in like 15 minutes or 20 minutes. That's the only times that I've done that, but not really. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, we keep refreshing, refreshing. I like to do this, I don't know why. <laughs> sometimes it will work, sometimes it won't. There's probably no orders anyway. But, let's see. You can see I'm um, 5 stars, I have 45 ratings. I'm pretty sure, like, busting this up, you can get better results. Because I, I was on 51. And then it's been slowly coming down and I don't know why because um, because I use I use the sticky notes all the time so I have all these filled up already and I stick the post-its on every single order to remind the customers to rate my service so yeah I don't know what's been going on um, but yeah, I keep doing it every day, every day, every day. Don't quit on that. I think it's one of the best advices to get customers rate you. Let's turn off the GPS again. The location, keep refreshing. And see, like I was showing you on, on, on the video that I posted this morning, um, you see Monday and Tuesday was pretty good and I was seeing a lot of batches like up to 19 like you saw on the video and yesterday and today yesterday I got to uh, 210 but I only had two good orders the first one at 36 and this one at 4 p.m. another 30 something dollars but you see it was only 10 all of them under $20 and I still got to 210 dollars it was 12 batches, 9 hours. Uh, I got home like at 9 p.m. And I started here at Costco at 10 a.m. So it was like, yeah, 
something like that to, to know it was like 12 hours 11 to 12 hours and so far today I'm at 95 after on only uh, four patches but you see uh, all of them over 20 uh, but I'm still waiting for my unicorn of today and here it is let's go we got it <laughs> that's good let's see what he has yeah that's another that's another 20 bucks um, as you can see sometimes if there is demand of course um, you will see these kind of orders and then you just gotta keep refreshing if it tells you to turn on the location turn it back on and keep refreshing uh, because your data like your phone data it's sending location anyway by your IP address and like kind of some by the tower that you are connected on um, so yeah but yeah, sometimes it's gonna ask you to uh, turn on the GPS location so yeah give that a try that's how I do it when I'm sitting at a store either it's Costco Publix or just sitting somewhere park so I don't drive a lot of miles gotta keep miles uh, low uh, but yeah you see that work now I'm gonna pick that patch and hope it's not gonna rain too much uh, I need to show you this I love all these scenarios here in Georgia it's gonna can you hear that I love this I love this I love how scary it looks but yeah that's that's what I do uh, I hope you have a great weekend and if I have more updates Tomorrow I'll uh, make another video because tomorrow I'm gonna wake up a lot earlier. Uh, I kind of drop my speed a little bit already, so tomorrow I'm gonna start like at seven and see if there's a lot of difference on the batches. As you can see right now, it was only one, two batches, three, but uh, Monday and Tuesday was like 10, 12, 15 all the time. Even when it was when I was at home already, like at 8:30 or 9, it was still 10 batches, eight batches available. And that's a lot better than not having any of them just having like you know even they're not all unicorns like over 20 or 30 you have 15 options to choose from and you already see that yesterday except for two orders all of them were under 20 and I still got to over $200 so excuse me keep that in mind uh, hope the, your day goes uh, very well and we'll see you probably this weekend with another update on this waking up early thing uh, we'll see how it goes I'll keep measuring stuff and yeah thank you for being here and have a great weekend bye